Alicia Keys discusses being forced to compromise in super dirty music industry The 15-time Grammy Award-winning singer-songwriter says she will never again allow anyone to try to mold her to the vision of her that they think she should be video loading video unavailable click to play tap to play the video will auto play soon 8 cancel play now Alicia Keys sings a heartfelt song for her living room concert set by Seamus Duff 15 colon 04 9th of November 2021 updated 15 colon 20 November 9th 2021 Comments Alicia Keys has branded the music industry as super dirty and has opened up about the way people in the industry tried to manipulate her image. The 40-year-old chart-topping star was just 20 years old when she burst onto the music scene with her debut single, Fallen Dash at which point she had already been performing and trying to crack the industry for seven years. The award-winning star is due to release her eighth studio album, titled Keys, next month and has been reflecting on her decades-long career. Thinking back on her experience of being a woman in the music world, the Best of Me singer says that she used to compromise in order to get her music out into the world, but says those days of giving up her way are over. Opening up to Marie Claire, she said, I think it's actually what saved me from this super dirty industry, which sometimes makes women feel like they don't have a choice about how to express themselves or portray their womanhood or their sensuality or their sexuality, or any of it. Growing up, I was very much around pimps, prostitutes and dealers. I had to conduct myself in a certain way in order to not attract that type of attention. It gave me perspective. As a kid, everyone wants to tell you what to do and how to look and how they want to market you. They literally try to mold you like clay. She continued, Compromise has been my middle name, Alicia Compromise Keys. I definitely came to a place where I was recognizing that my desire to compromise sometimes overcame my desire to honor my original vision. She added, you know, I'm just finished with giving my power away. Alicia also explained that her new record is an exploration of womanhood and that she hopes she can encourage other women to achieve their, most magnificent, most fancy, smart beautiful, selves, by abandoning their inhibitions. Last year, Alicia credited her music career with helping her escape from a path of prostitution and drug addiction. Speaking to The Guardian at the time, the mom of two says growing up in the Hell's Kitchen neighborhood of New York in the 1980s was intimidating, with hookers on every corner. She said, I am that person, the underdog, the one that wasn't supposed to make it out of Hell's Kitchen, who was supposed to end up being a prostitute, a young mother at 16 years old, or addicted to drugs. I am the one who is supposed to be in the wrong place at the wrong time and got injured or killed. She went on to explain that the rough neighborhood had an effect on her dress sense and style. Alicia explained, I had to always wear something very baggy, very dark, always had my hair back, I felt like if people saw me, they might try to touch me. That's why I've always been such a tomboy. Alicia Keys covers the November digital issue of Marie Claire, and the interview is available to read in full now here. Follow Mirror Facebook Twitter comment.